Welcome to Gladiary. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for tuning in. God bless you. If you're yet to subscribe, kindly subscribe and get to know much more about the life of a domestic worker. I mean, life experience of Nigeria housemaid. Today, you'll be seeing me how I live my life with my co worker. This is Interracia housemaid in Omar. See how we are bathing and facing our differences culture chop and so many things so we have two africa here and south asia which is known as bangladesh with me today <laughs> We are working for same family but in different houses they were with me working together just like a gig to help me out because we are having get together little family party so as you all know that i'm working in family house we have a lot of things to do together salam alaikum <laughs> Ewa. <laughs> The Bangladesh among us do remind me when I just start working as housemaid, maybe I'm facing a language barrier. If you say something, we have to repeat it series of time before she could uh, cash on. As you can see, when I'm saying salam alaikum, then when I'm trying to make her to greet my people on YouTube, she didn't catch up on time. So I'm was in that situation when everything being said be like, what are they trying to say what is this so we got the cake we went to pick actually this my friend were not allowed to go outside like i do so this is a way to cite suhin for them we are back home and also having a tea chat as i'm cutting the cake because uh, a lot of people are waiting to enjoy this with coffee as you can see on the freezer but we are having all right all right all right Here with me, I have my male co-worker with 20 years experience in the same house I am and I have 4 years and I have the other Tanzania lady have 3 years and uh, the Bangladesh have 4 months and this is what happened between with the Bangladesh and the Africa. We have this cultural differences uh, as you all know that I show you the video how I do my bloating exercise so I try to do it outside when we are less busy and she saw me she was like why am i doing that and she take it so serious to the extent that she tried to punish me because she's the eldest among us we women but with experience she has the most least experience as housemaid you can see something that we africa can do anyhow or outside that we see that it's normal to them it seems like we are doing something that's People shouldn't be seen or they'll be taking a soap personal. So you'll be seeing how she was just dragging my leg and people were like, why is she doing that to me? And she was saying it in her own language that uh, what I'm doing is not proper and it's a normal thing. We can exercise both indoor and outdoor, but to them it wasn't. So this is a habit showing my experience with you as a Miss Housemaid in Omani Home. Thanks for watching and bye.